on that. Mine's terrible too. Well, tomorrow is the uh, one of New Orleans' favorite holidays. It's French Bread Day. Is that like a national holiday? Yeah. Oh, and Kevin is in the kitchen this morning making three different kinds of po' boys using French bread. And you know what? A po I mean, boy wouldn't be a po' boy. There were so many French bread. different ways we could have gone. We could have made bread pudding. We could have made French toast, pan perdu. Yeah. Because we use the French bread so, so much. We use it for way, stuffings. You pick the right way. I picked the right way? You picked the right way. And I'm, I'm telling you what, you were talking about three different po' boys, but a combination of all that stuff on one po' boy would be kind we of awesome. We might have to try that. We you might have to, you, we, we might open up a new shop. And by, so, what, what is this, this, I thought this was for me to, the, what is this thing, this little To lean here? on? Well, no, what I thought it was gonna be is for me to stand on so I could be your height. <laughs> <laughs> Counters are usually so low. Oh, for you, that's true, Monica yeah. Monica had that made for me <laughs> as a present, so that's I don't have funny. to bend over cutting you know, it's, yeah. And so you never forget your name. It says Chef Kevin Belton on it. <laughs> That's right, for when I get old. <laughs> it's like, who am I? <laughs> oh, oh, there it is there. I can see it on the screen. All right. That's why on my chef's jacket, I have my name backwards sometimes so I can look down and see it. Like with the ambulance on the, yeah, uh, the exactly. rear mirror? Yeah, <laughs> exactly, exactly. So here's what we're doing with the shrimp. I've, I, I've peeled and deveined the shrimp. And you, 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 you put them in cold, don't you? Yeah, you want them as cold as can yeah, be. Yeah, like you've iced them down stuff a lot of times. Now, what I did this morning, this is buttermilk and eggs. Whipped okay. a couple of eggs, put in a little buttermilk, put the shrimp in, and I had them sitting in the refrigerator. All right. Staying cold because things fry better when they're cold. And now, is this a corn or a flour? I have a combination. I have a little bit of fish fry, a little okay. bit of flour, some seasoning. You want to make sure your oil is hot. Yeah, that's, that's one key. of the neat things about these little electric fryers is that they maintain the heat, they maintain the temperature. Okay. You know, so now how often do you have to change the grease in a little one like that? With the little one? Oh, I'd use it once and then I'm done because you don't have to use that much. That's true. So, but you know what? I don't fry a lot at home. I'll eat fried food out. Yeah. But I don't fry at home a lot. But if you do. I would have guessed a guy trim and slim like you, you never had fried food. You know, actually, I'm a vegetarian. <laughs> yeah. You know, I like vegetables <laughs> underneath the meat. You just have big bones. Yes, big bones. <laughs> that's right. I'm a little bloated today. <laughs> yeah, but you me see, too. This is the trick with frying too, Eric. As you can see, is the oil is hot. This goes in, and look how crispy the shrimp are. And the you want to get them in at the same time because because they cook pretty fast. They do. They won't take long. And now, you don't want to overcook them. Then they get rubbery. The other thing we have going on with this today is I have I made some meatballs earlier. Yeah. Bake those in the oven. You know, made that red gravy that we have here in New Orleans. Now I've just had those simmering. And what what kind of meat is that? That's just uh... beef, veal, and pork. Ooh, that's a nice I combination. Use, yeah, yeah. I put them all in. Okay. Now here's how we're gonna make this really special. You know what? You got about ten seconds to tell me. Okay. Butter and garlic and parsley. We're gonna put that on the bread. The meatballs. Crush zaps on top of it. Woo. That's that's an awesome sandwich. Yes. All right. Uh, remember, you can get uh, Kev Shevin. Chef, Chef Kevin. Kevin's, thank you, it's right here on the thing. <laughs> Chef Kevin's recipe on our website at WWLTV.com. Just look for the morning show page.